Happy Monday. Welcome to My Carolina Today. That is right. It is Monday. Everybody's ready for the week. And if you were hanging out this weekend, you probably caught the NBA Finals. Yes. OMG. I thought things, I thought the walls, I was going to have to hold the walls together in my house. <laughs> my boyfriend was screaming from here to another land in Egypt. Now, he is a, an Ohio native. Yes. And he loves to do that, the chant. Yes. Oh, like, H. I O. I O. Yes. So for him, this is serious. <laughs> it's serious. Yeah. He actually watched LeBron, LeBron play in high school. Mm -hmm. So before he was big, 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 and everybody yeah. knew who he was, he would actually play him. Or he didn't, Nate, Nate didn't play basketball. Don't get it twisted. But they actually watched him play. So for him, he always feels like yeah. he's got LeBron blood uh -huh. in him. <laughs> Literally, <laughs> he must have hit the floor and stood up 17 times. Like, it was like, <gasps> it's great. <gasps> It's great. It was like down and up, down and up. I, I had to, I told Velado when I came in today, I was like, it was like I was in a movie theater and I was in the last seat in the back row. Yeah. And I was just like, let me just stay back here and let whatever's going to happen in the front yeah. happen. It was good. It was, it was very good. good. I if you missed it, it, you should go. Now, and if you didn't watch from the very beginning, go to YouTube or Google Carlos and Cindy Santana. Amazingness, I heard. They slayed the national anthem. Do we have a little bit of I think we've got a little bit of it. A little taste of it, do we? Yeah, there it is. This is very different, I feel like, for the NBA, too, because I'm mm -hmm. used to, and maybe it's just because I don't watch every single game in the very yeah. beginning, but I'm more used to hearing, like, they bring out a little singer, and she hits the notes, mm -hmm. and everybody claps and prays that, like, she doesn't miss the high <laughs> note. You know, I always get nervous that they're going to, like, be screeching or something uh -huh. and be like, oh, God, in front of all those people. Yeah, so, well, Carlos yeah. lives in the Bay, so perfect for the... Golden State to bring him in, so it was a lot of yeah, good stuff. A lot of energy. It was great. So I was okay. doing the NBA, and you were planting. I was doing the NBA too. Okay, and planting. Yes, yes I, I planted on Saturday morning. <laughs> I planted my garden. There's my little garden. <laughs> I love Yay it. Yay for my little garden. We need your flowers here, Valon. There is a daisy. <laughs> I have tomatoes, peppers, basil, cilantro, and sweet potatoes. Oh my gosh. And so it doesn't look like much now, but in a few weeks it'll be a whole lot. And maybe I'll bring in some to share. I am so hopefully. impressed with your gardening talents right well, now. Well, Lylan helped me. She helped <laughs> me spread the awesome. soil and dig the holes. And, you know, we had a, a good old time oh my gosh. on Saturday morning. But none of my stuff is ready to go. So oh. I had to go to the farmer's market on Sunday afternoon. Which I've been hearing about this farmer's market. Oh. It's apparently the bomb. I have not been to the, the farmer's market. I know. Man, I'm I left so late to the no game. No cash. None. None? None. Oh. <laughs> See, that's what happens to me when I go to the mall. So now I know. I, I can relate to this feeling. Lila nearly <laughs> ate all the blackberries before we could get home. She was eating them in the car. Oh my gosh. And the peaches, I used some in a dish I made last night. Then we ate some and the apple butter, we had that and the strawberries oh my and the gosh. apple chips and the fresh squeezed Woo! lemonade. Oh. <laughs> it sounds like it was go really back good. Again this week. All right, well, the farmer's market on my next list of places to visit. <laughs> Valana is always keeping me in check. Let me tell you what. She always is telling me, Alex, you need to drink more water, save your money, <laughs> all this stuff. So today I saw a Kickstarter that I was like, we got to share this with the world because it was made for me probably by ways they heard Valana talking to me and they were like, we need to make Alex something to help her. Okay. So I don't drink enough water. There's a Kickstarter that was created called Hydrate Me. Yeah. And basically this company wants to make a water bottle that syncs to your phone to track your water water intake and it mm. glows to remind you to stay hydrated. That's cool. Yeah. So I like it. And for me, I'm always like, I just forget to drink water sometimes. Okay. I know Vlad is like, I don't have this problem. <laughs> but <laughs> she's like, okay. Okay. People like you. Tell me about it. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, so it's a reusable water bottle. And the cool thing about it for people like me is that it glows so that maybe you're sitting at your desk, you're working, all mm -hmm. of a sudden if your if your drink starts glowing, yeah. it's gonna make you be like, oh yeah. Let me drink. That's you know, cool. Whatever, whatever it takes. Your water bottle can't talk to you, yeah. so this is the closest Get that thing. water in. I like it. Yeah, so you can help them raise money for it. If you're interested in it, you can go to kickstarter.com and search Hydrate Me. Okay, we still have a concert giveaway. It Woo! is for Idina Menzel. She's coming to the Red Hat Amphitheater. So head over to our website, mycarolinatoday.com, and click on Contest to enter. The tickets include VIP club access to the show, and the show is July 22nd, so if you want those tickets, go get them. All right, good stuff there. And then we've got American Dance. What's yes, going on with that? the American Dance Festival kicks off this week in Durham and goes through July 25th. Look at this picture here. What is that? The woman sitting on the stage with the headband with their hands together. Just take a wild guess as to who that could be. Oh my, I don't, I don't know. Valanda, you know I don't know the dance stuff and I should you know. You don't need to know dance okay, wait, stuff. Okay, wait, wait, wait. She's a pop star. She's one a of pop the star? biggest pop stars 
in the world goes by one name. Uh, Madonna. Oh, Madonna? That's Madonna at the American Dance Festival Shut the front in door. Durham in 1978. That Thank girl you. with the headband? Yes. Madonna was she was in North Carolina? Carolina? Yes. What? I am yes. so out of the loop. Cause, oh, gosh. That's Madonna laughing. before Everybody's she laughing was. At me. Madonna. They're like, how do you not know, Alex, that Madonna was in North Carolina? Was I well, I didn't know that. You didn't? Okay, no. good. That makes me feel but better. Thank you to the Raleigh News and Observer <laughs> for that photo and the article. But yes, she attended in 1978. That's cool. A few years before her debut album came out. Wow. That's yeah. really fascinating history. Yeah, to know but that the Madonna. festival is incredible. You can go there and take classes. You can also attend performances from some modern dance companies. So very cool starting stuff. this week. Look at Madonna. There she is, Madonna Shaconi. So you know what? There she looks a lot more like her daughter. I see. Lourdes, I see. Yeah. yeah. What is it? What is Lourdes? Lourdes. Thank mm -hmm. you. Yeah, she does look a lot like Lourdes there. All right. Good stuff. Well, all this history here. All right.